What's up guys, it's Steeman10 here, and today I'll be showing you how to save your SHSH files or blobs on any device, on any firmware, if you want to downgrade or do something to your device. Um, a lot of people have been requesting this video, commenting, messaging me, saying it's not working for me, how do I save this, so I'm just going to show you how to do it. You're going to want to downgr download, <laughs> downgrade. Tiny Umbrella. This program right here is for Windows and Mac. Just let it load up here. Now make sure when you do open this program that iTunes is closed. Just hit OK to both of these. So you don't require. They don't have anything to do with you. Um, make sure you have the latest version, 5.0.09. And if you're watching this video at a later date, it might be a different uh, or higher version. You're going to want to click over here to your device, and you see that I have two uh, softwares saved um, on my iPhone. Down here, you can see your device model. It'll show you your serial number, a bunch of stuff. Um, here's a log where you can, when you start the TSS server to downgrade, it shows you what it's doing. That's pretty cool. In advance, um, you can save all available SHSH. You keep all this checked. It's always checked anyway. And it saves it on your computer also as a backup. But um, mainly what this does is saves it in your device. So when you go to downgrade, the device tells the computer or iTunes to let it downgrade when iTunes doesn't want it to. So this helps downgrading if no one knew it, what that meant. So in the corner here, like I said in a couple comments, you can hit save SHSH. It's going to run its thing down here, and you're just going to wait for this bar to go all the way across. Actually, I haven't done this in a while, so maybe I'll get some firmware saved. Now, like I said before, this is very, very important to do on every firmware that you update to. Because now, if you're stuck on something, you can't get it. See now I got two new firmwares here, 4.2.9 and 4.2.10, oh, which I don't even think there's a firmware, but I don't know, I'm not sure. But um, this now this says on my device it is saved. So now if uh, this these uh firmwares come out or um a new firmware comes out and I update it to it on accident, I don't know how people do that, but. If it pops up in iTunes and asks you to update, don't update unless you hear from me that you can jailbreak or downgrade on it, okay? So don't update unless you hear from me. I'll upload a video for you guys. Um, so this is all the stuff. So if you accidentally update, you can downgrade to any of these listed below, okay? So that's how you save it. Same thing on Windows. It's the same exact process. You can see all the people I've done. My friends. I've saved all their SHSH files and that's how you do it right so hopefully that helped clear up some confusion I'll talk to you guys in the next video peace